The next is Councillor Holliday. Madam Speaker, I, I would like to ask my questions of uh, Dep uh, District Chief Leak. Would he be here? Chief Leak is not here. Yes, sir. is the appropriate person to ask your questions of. Well, I think in view of what we're dealing with here, uh, we're dealing with uh, the chief saying one thing and a report th that we've received from somebody else saying something else. It, uh, as a councillor, to get full impact here, I'd like to be able to hear the comments from the gentleman that wrote this report. Well, that is the appropriate to line is the chief so the chief is here if you have a question please ask it so you don't think it's appropriate to have the writer of the report here a very serious report like this councillor i'd like to i'd like to move that this matter be set down and that we uh, phone the gentleman and ask him to come over here you're at the point of asking questions councillor no, but i i want to ask questions of an individual that isn't here so, so i would like i would like to move that we invite that well, you're individual not in a position to come here right now councillor you are not in a position right now to move anything. You are asking questions. Well, when, when would I be able to when ask to speak. speak to this person then? When you speak. Pardon? When if this is speak. questions of staff, when would I expect to ask to speak you to this will, person? You will need to win the vote when you speak and you place your motion. No, but the, the, the chance to address staff is now. And, and I, the staff I'd like to address is not here. So I would like to make a motion to invite that staff. Maybe council won't that. agree with me, I'm but I think you should at least put the motion. Well, at the appropriate time, councillor. Pardon? At the appropriate time, you but may the appropriate time motion. is now. The staff is on the floor now. I, I just right. want the right staff. I have ruled, and that is the appropriate manner. You can put a motion. You can request that that individual come forward and see if council agrees with you. Well, that's what exactly what I'd like to do. Well, you may do that. I'd like to do it right now, though. Well, you can't do it right now. Well, if you can't ask the staff the questions that you want to ask them, how are you now, supposed to treat this? Am I supposed to set this not, aside? Councillor, do you have a question? This is well, not I, I guess I want the chief just to tell me outright that this isn't right, well, that the conclusion the that's in this report is that the uh, TTC ROW as constructed on St. Clair Avenue West is not usable by Toronto Fire Service for emergency response. Is that right or wrong? And my comment, Councillor, has been that we'll use it right away to the best of our ability. Is this, is this comment wrong then? based on the way Bob has written the report in terms of exclusive re exclusivity of response for it. So it's not right? I would say that. That's correct. I mean, I've walked... Well, have you spoken to this individual like, to find out why they wrote this? It was it based on the exclusivity of the use of the right-of-way on, on a full-time basis? And that was not the intent for fire services, it is to use the road surface. Well, I what about the fact that he says that the, it's important to point out that the average six meter road it will now be only available, the only available access to access fire. There will no doubt be delays in emergency vehicle responses on St. Clair Avenue from what they were along the areas of the TTC ROW prior to and after construction. So before this happened, there was a, a better chance for you to have a better response time. Based on our response time numbers I've got, Councillor, on average, we ran 556 calls from 2006 to the present date. Our response time is within within our guidelines. Yeah, but is for it the as area. good as it was before? Well, if I look at it in uh, 2006, it was four minutes and 16 seconds. 2007, 428. Uh, year to date, 446. Overall average for three years, 425. Are you is it, is it snow well? conditions? Is it climatic conditions? Is it traffic congestion? Is it densification? Can I say it's the right of way? No, I can't say it's the right of way. Then is this statement incorrect? Well, based on the numbers I've got that he wouldn't have ran at the time, I'm giving you the opinion that we can use the right of way. Have you spoke to this gentleman about these incorrect statements? I have spoken to him, yes. What did he say? Well, he certainly, uh, certainly he's aware of uh, the content of the report. and. Uh, and based on his and his beliefs uh, for usability, that was his comment at the time. How long has the gentleman been with the fire department? A uh, number of years. 20 years? 20, 25 years. 25 years, and he's a district chief. In our emergency and planning And he writes center. a report that isn't accurate. 
I would not say it's not accurate. I, what I would say oh. to you is, is that, let's, let's be fair here, is that the, he wrote it from a perspective of exclusive use of the right-of-way for total emergency response. That's not how we use the right-of-ways. I'm sorry, Councillor Holliday, your time is done. Well, as I said, you may place that motion.